while giving you study plan i made you comfortable with this that this particular topic is history this particular topic is history aur aap usko kitni conveniently geography banate ho wahi aapka answer ka level decide karega means you have to focus on the nature of territorial allocation ek bahut basic sa point hai soch kar dekhenge jab hum kehte hain 1956 se 66 ke beech mein we had linguistic reorganization so you are aware of it to hum isko kyu discuss kar rahe hain 1956 से 66 the 56 the 55 states reorganization commission passing up of states reorganization act 56 that marked up the beginning of linguistic reorganization sab log likhenge telugu speaking andhra pradesh came into being to kya sirf telugu speaking andhra pradesh develop hua tha 56 mein nahi the treven core was mixed with malayalam speaking core to create kerala to aap kya kar rahe ho geography add kar rahe ho you are trying to add the territorial allocation aur wohi aapke answer ko make or break kare you have to create a geographical perspective of this chronological top or please try to focus on that otherwise we all know how many stages we can divide chronologically temporally how many stages we can divide states reorganization already implemented in our country teen unka time frame kitna hai wo immaterial after attainment of independence till 1950 to khali 3 saal ka kaam kar rahe hain it was consolidation phase it created the indian political map by 1950 with part a part b and part c states of the country uske baad 6 saal ka leap le liya 56 se 66 tak matlab 1950 se lekar 1956 tak kuch major nahi hai states reorganization 56 to 66 it is linguistic reorganization jisme majorly har student baat karta hai andhra pradesh 60 mein marathi speaking maharashtra and gujarati speaking gujarat और 66 में हिंदी स्पीकिंग हरियाणा काव्ड आउट फ्रॉम पंजाबी स्पीकिंग पंजाब और काम खत्म बट इसमें जब आप टेरिटोरियल अलोकेशन ऐड करोगे आप अपने आप इस आंसर को ज्योग्राफिक बनाओ आफ्टर 66 स्टेट्स रीऑर्गेनाइजेशन स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम 1971 टिल 2019 नाइनटीन बाइफरकेशन ऑफ जम्मू एंड कश्मीर उसमें एक जियो पोलिटिकल एज है बट इकोनॉमिक भी तो है so you take all of them of course except sikkim some of you suggested in virtual class sikkim example yes sikkim was a protectorate of the country aur china ka aaj tak bhi reservation hai sikkim ke political status par it was based on the plebiscite sikkim people voted to be part of indian territory that in 75 the earthswell plebiscite of the country earthswell protectorate of the country was ceded as the state of indian union So, 75 का वो एक इंसिडेंस अलग कर दे तो 71 से लेकर 2019 तक का सारा डेवलपमेंट चाहे उसमें फिर चार मेजर स्टेट्स का बाइफरकेशन है इन ईयर 2000 बिहार मध्य प्रदेश एंड इतना सोचोगे उत्तर प्रदेश एंड व्हेन आई टेक अप दाइफरकेशन ऑफ आंध्र प्रदेश एंड देन रेवोकेशन ऑफ आर्टिकल 370 सेवेंटी एंड बाइफरकेशन ऑफ जम्मू एंड कश्मीर सब के सब एग्जाम्पल ऑफ इकोनॉमिक है I was originally a union territory and I was elevated to state Goa Arunachal Pradesh 1987 economic hai so you can easily give the location and dimension of the spatial domain aur aap conclude kaise karte ho even if the second part of the topic would not have been the syllabus indian constitution do provides provision for recognition for new states on the political map of earth anything and everything that will make india satisfy the nature of federalism that we are having holding together we are not the example of federalism which is coming together so we are so diverse that we need to recognize that diversity and whenever such demand for the new state could evolves satisfying certain criteria you are we are our constitution is absolutely open ended for giving recognition to new and new state there are many examples which are there in the pipeline some of them are more highlighted ones some of them are less highlighted but they all are so hum char part mein apne study ko divide kare bahut basic sa topic hai but bahut important hai states reorganization emergence of new states in india point number 1 1947 se india marked the beginning of consolidation phase consolidation q required tha at the time of attainment of independence forget about tribal area and the smaller other colonial territory tab bhi 40% of our territory was princely state it was important for us to consolidate them otherwise india ka to map hi evolve nahi hota 
we don't get into the details of how department of state with everything which we call sam dam dand bhed sab kuch liya sardar ballabh bhai patel that actually led to the seeding up of such territories within the political boundary of india generating map of india hum wo chronology ko nahi highlight karte because we are not historians we are geographers so we simply said 40% of the princely state of variable size and variable degree of autonomy were required to be ceded in india otherwise india ka to map hi evolve nahi hota britishers by default gave them the choice aapki marzi india mein jana chaho pakistan mein jana chaho independent rehna chaho tabhi to abhi covid time mein jab pakistan ne apna naya map develop kara to junagadh ko apna territory dikhaya marzi जब चाइना कर रहा है तो चलो मैं भी अपनी मर्जी दिखा दूं। ओके सो व्हेन वी टेक द रेफरेंस ऑफ दिस कंसोलिडेशन फेज एज जोग्राफर व्हाट आई शुड गिव एग्जामिनर दो चीजें अगर ये आ गया तो आपका आंसर फुल प्रूफ जोग्राफिकल डायमेंशन में बना नंबर वन जूनागढ़ हैदराबाद एंड जम्मू एंड कश्मीर का स्पेसिफिक मैंशन आना चाहिए जूनागढ़ हैदराबाद एंड जम्मू एंड कश्मीर में पब्लिक ओपिनियन बाई डिफॉल्ट वॉज इन इंडियन फेवर निजाम वॉज स्लाइटली मोर एडमिंट जम्मू एंड कश्मीर के केस में कॉम्प्लेक्सिटी पाकिस्तान के आर्म्ड इन्वेजन से बढ़ गई एंड विद यू एन सिक्योरिटी काउंसिल इंटरवेंशन एंड सीजफायर लाइन वी ऑल नो दैट साउथ एशिया टूडे इज जियो पोलिटिकली सेंसिटिव बिकॉज द काइंड ऑफ रिलेशन द टू जायंट ऑफ दिस रीजन आर हैविंग इंडिया एंड पाकिस्तान और इंडिया पाकिस्तान के बीच का जो रिलेशन है उसके कहीं ना कहीं बेस में फॉल्ट लाइन में Pakistan occupied Kashmir line of control hai so we take it to be a very important development that india is bearing the burden of even till date so we take that as first very important point aur dusra bahut important point consolidation phase ka jo apne last mein likha by 1950 of course wahan par war and un security council ka intervention etc chal raha hai but by 1950 map of republic of india इनकॉर्पोरेटेड छोटे अदर कलोनियल टेरिटरीज हैं हम उनकी बात नहीं कर रहे इंडियन मैप इनकॉर्पोरेटेड थ्री कैटेगरीज ऑफ स्टेट कौन कौन से कैटेगरी स्टेट ए वर एक्चुअली फॉर्मल ब्रिटिश प्रोविंस तो भाई पोलिटिकल इंडिपेंडेंस और पार्टीशन इलेक्शन के बाद ही तो हुए थे तो इलेक्टेड गवर्नर एंड स्टेट लेजिस्लेचर इज द कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ ग्रुप ए स्टेट ग्रुप बी कौन से हुए the earth's while princely states they by default were governed by raj pramukh that was appointed by president or c kaun sa group hua c were those groups which were governed by commissioners jinka koi defined british territory ya princely states se domain nahi hai kutch bahut acha example hai which was eventually added in 1956 to bombay enlarging the territory of bombay and then two dominant locations that is in northeastern part tripura and manipur as geographer you should take them as example of state part c i think this is comfortable get on to block number 2 linguistic reorganization acha it goes like this it was then indian national congress aaj ki congress ki baat nahi kar rahe it was then indian national congress that actually in the beginning of 20th century started mobilizing language as the tool towards generating mass support against the colonial power to facilitate that mass struggle to attain independence mother tongue could attain language could attain that political mainstreaming because of using the same language that is spoken by the masses you automatically communicate with them much more easier this was the realization that made the freedom fighters of course the most dominating party that time was indian national congress taking language into the political mainstreaming people started realizing recognizing their cultural identities on language because of the kind of linguistic grouping and mass agitation that we successfully created that was the reason that linguistic reorganization of state cropped in as soon as we attained independence 
India attained independence with a very troubling political partition, which was largely on the part on the basis of religious line. We all are aware of it. The mass movement of people displaced here and there, and the actual in human domain that all evolved, putting on to a success of divide and rule and two nation policy of the Britishers. We definitely never wanted anything of that sort to crop up again. We were so fragile culturally that time that language certainly could not be given the recognition as was demanded by the masses. So the party which actually created linguistic identity was the party that came into power and did everything that it could to somewhere sideline the demand for linguistic reorganization. However, the series of incidences that took place as more than 100 years of the history of demand of the Telugu speaking state Andhra Pradesh led to states reorganization commission established in 1955, leading to the second phase of linguistic reorganization. We can encounter a separate short length question on linguistic reorganization because, mind it, cultural regions of India is based on language. Next point. The economic phase precisely incorporate a existing union territories being given the status of state of Indian Union, Himachal Pradesh in 1971, Goa and Arunachal Pradesh in 1987. B bifurcation of existing state bifurcation of existing states as uttar pradesh madhya pradesh bihar in year 2000 bracket me liklo developing uttarakhand chhattisgarh <coughs> and jharkhand close the bracket bifurcation of Andhra Pradesh 2014 bracket Telangana coming in being Telangana coming in being or created star mark likhenge example revocation of article 370 with bifurcation of state of Jammu and Kashmir forms the example of both economic and geopolitical decision. The reorganization of Indian state with ever evolving cultural identity, statehood in demand. So, Vidarbha, Gorkha land, Bodo land, somewhere overcast our domain. Major minor is nothing to do with size. Major minor ka domain kya hai? Major is that which involves the reoccurring public ag agitation. Matlab, it doesn't fade out of our mind and there is a new agitation that begins. Minor wo hai, jo itna zada showcase nahi kar rahe apna demand, but that is there. This is how we are dividing it. Emergence of new state likha bhi hua hai, isle bhi zaruri hai. And then we are aware of the fact that boundaries evolve as per evolution of cultural identity. 